I've known about this secret exhibition now for about two months and finally the dinosaur is out of the bag because the National Museum Wales have secured one of the most amazing fossils I have ever seen in my life. This is a theropod dinosaur, the same lineage that you would see with uh, Velociraptor or even, even T-Rex, king of the dinosaurs. It's a meat eater, it's about the specimen that we have in there about two meters long, about 60 centimeters high. It's a Welsh dinosaur. And it's not just important here in Wales. It is not just important here in the UK. This dinosaur is the best preserved specimen I have seen of an early Jurassic uh, dinosaur anywhere in the world. It, we are not looking at a fragment of tooth or or skull, we are looking at a 40% complete specimen. On a global stage, this is exceptional. Uh, in March last year, Nick, Nick run me up, because Nick lives in Preston, uh, and I live in Cardiff, telling me it was the lowest tide of the year. So uh, went down Lavenock Point, there's a lot of the area that's not exposed at other times of the year. Um, after a couple of hours of not finding anything, I went back to the car with an empty rucksack. And on my way back, there'd been a recent rockfall, so I thought I'd just have a look in, in the rockfall. Um, after rummaging about in the rocks, I noticed something which looked a bit strange in one of them, so I put that to one side, rummaged about a bit more and found another few blocks which had what looked like bones sticking out of them. Um, so I put them in my rucksack, put them in the back of the car, drove home, rang Nick, said, oh, I think I've got something a bit odd at the moment. Uh, so I took it to some photos, sent them up to him in Preston. He drove down, then we spent the next few weeks going down Lavenock Point at various times, uh, which we found the skull block then. We found that separately to the first blocks that were found. Um, yeah, so that's how it was found, really. Nick spent hours sieving through bits of rubble and mud and stuff and came away with a few vertebrates like that but you know really good work to get them out of the rubbish because they would have just dissolved in the sea. It's the first new species of dinosaur in the UK for 30 years. It's the most complete lower Jurassic theropod in the world and at the very base of the Jurassic there is only fragmentary remains that have been found so this is a really important find to science also a really important find for Wales as well. The, the museum is, is, is overwhelmed by this, um, the, this, this dinosaur. It's the, probably the most important fossil that you could ever consider coming out of an area, particularly somewhere like Wales, which isn't renowned for its Jurassic rocks. There's only a tiny portion of Jurassic rocks in Wales. But to have a dinosaur like this in Wales on display in the museum, the museum is, is, is overwhelmed. It's, it's fantastic to be able to show people such an amazingly important specimen.